everyone and welcome back to Homestead Rewind. Today, me and Jay are going to take a road trip. Come along and see where we're going. Driving into the sun. I'm hoping that all these clouds are gone by the time we get down there. Guys, it's kind of a bummer because it is raining, but at the same time, I wouldn't have been able to have this opportunity had it not been raining because our plans for the weekend were to work on the mini coop. Since it's raining, I get to do something really, really special. Kevin and Sarah from Living Traditions are going to be at their farmer's market in Ava. And Ava's just a little short road trip from where we live, a beautiful one. Unfortunately, I'm not able to take pictures. Maybe on the way back, I can get some of that scenery in. Um, my camera just wants to focus on the raindrops. You guys with YouTube, you know the pain I'm in. <laughs> However, I am truly excited to meet these two and maybe get me some veggies um, to put in my raised container gardens. Most of you that have been watching know that we have really implemented a lot of the ideas that we've gotten from Living Traditions. So that's what makes it really, really special for me to meet them in person and be able to thank them in person for all their great ideas and their encouragement. We stopped here at the McDonald's in Seymour. We drove through so much beautiful country, Amish country at that. There are several ways that you can get from Ava to Buffalo, and every single one of them are pretty drives. I'm so happy the sun's coming out. Yeah. Maybe the trip back I can get some good pictures. Said near downtown. Close to the downtown square, I think, is what that said on there. They got them a little home center. Yep. House of nine acres. Uh, but they won't have ton for it since it's in the city limits. Probably, even though the house looks unlivable. Yep. There's the downtown district. I, I think we've been downtown Ava before. I actually feel like we've been to this swap meet before, or farmer's market, and it seems like they have some really cool little shops down there. Every town has some cool little shops. Most of them in Missouri do. Okay, we're on the square. It seems to be where the most traffic is headed. I guess I should have took some time and figured out where we're going. Yep. Look, there's a hidden treasure shop. Ooh. Let me see. Go to their Facebook page. At the Ava Community Center. Oh, yeah. I forgot that. So that's what we need to be looking for. Yeah. Ava Community Center. Oh, that's not right. <laughs> Right onto South Jefferson Street. Continue on South Jefferson Street for one mile. Okay. Heard the Mark Twain National Forest back there. Yeah. Quarter mile. Turn right onto East Lincoln Avenue. There's the hidden treasure. Take the second right onto East Lincoln Avenue, then turn left onto South Spurlock Street. See, there's a thrift store over there. Yeah, Antique stores. I ain't gotta get no work done. Take the, the next left antiques. onto South Spurlock Street, then turn right onto East Benton Avenue. Right, right onto East Benton yep. Avenue, then That's your destination will be on the right. Uh, I'm excited. Where am I supposed to park? And a little bit nervous. Busy place. 
Huh? It's a busy place. Yeah. I guess. But I have cauliflower, cabbage, <laughs> That was exciting. I was a little bit nervous about meeting him, but they're exactly the same in person as they are in real life. Let me tell you something. That place was busy, and so they didn't have a whole lot of time, and I didn't want to take too much of their time, but they did stop to get a picture with me. On the way back, we stopped at this little area. It's really, really cool. Like the creek. It's truly interesting how little nooks in Missouri. I mean, we have a lot of these places like this in Missouri. They just appear out of the middle of seeming like nowhere. A representation of a long, long time of water carving down through there. I can't believe how busy that highway is. It's a little bit loud. Got a nice picnic area. These tree roots are just cool. Ancient sycamores. Look at the holes that the woodpeckers have made. Just beautiful. If you ever are driving down Highway 5 South in Missouri, south of Mansfield, look for this place. It's really pretty. It really is.